Hi, I'm Dr. Gab and DJ Lasky, and welcome to another episode of Lasky Bar. I'm a music producer, DJ, and bartender. Today I will show you the iconic James Bond's Shake and Not Stirred Vodka Martini and we will try to understand the difference between the classic martini that is stirred and not shaken. In addition, I will show you how to make the Vesper Martini, the drink made famous by Bond in the Casino Royale. Let's start! For the vodka martini, we need ice, two ounces of vodka, half an ounce of dry vermouth. Obviously, we have to shake it. A martini glass with double strain in the glass, and the lemon peel. The vodka martini. For the gin martini, otherwise, we need the ice, two ounce and a half of gin, your or my favorite gin, half. Half an ounce of dry vermouth, stir, 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 not shaken, stir, and double strain in a martini glass. And obviously a lemon peel. In the glass. The gin martini. Okay, as you can see, the main difference, besides the fact that there is vodka and not gin, is that the shaken drink is more cloudy than the stirred drink, which is much clearer. This is because when the ice gets shaken, it breaks and creates uh, some particles that uh, go into the drink. The ice particles created as a result of shaking obviously add water to the cocktail and therefore decrease the percentage of the alcohol. This is why people say that uh, shake a martini is wrong, because you alter the content of the cocktail. So, why James Bond order it shaken and not stirred? There are so many different answers to this question, but my favorite is that James Bond take it shaken so he can keep beating the bad guys, flirting with girls and drinking a few more cocktails before finishing a poker game. But speaking of poker games, I have to show you another drink, the famous Vesper Martini. But for this drink, I have to change my clothes and go ask a bond directly. Dry Martini. Oui, monsieur. Wait. Three measures of Gordon's, one of vodka, half a measure of Kina Lille, shake it over rice and then add a thin slice of lemon peel. Yes, sir. Okay, bond says three ounces of Gordon Jean. One ounce of Russian vodka and half an ounce of Kina Lille. Kina Lille is no longer produced, instead they created the Lille Blanc. Obviously, check, 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 check. Double strain in a martini glass. The lemon peel. Well, so this is Vesper Martini, obviously shaken, not stirred. And now we try them all. This is the vodka martini. I feel like a secret agent. This is the gin martini. 
Mm, classy. I feel like a gentleman in a poker club. And this is the Vesper Martini. Now I feel like James Bond. Remember, drink responsibly, never drink and drive. I hope you enjoyed the video, subscribe to the channel and click on the bell to stay updated too for the next videos. Link in description for all my music, my radio show and all my social networks. That's all for today from Dr. Carl and DJ Lasky. Peace! Devi fare la donna, la gente se...